Hi, I'm Dr. Shah. I was the National Lecture Competition winner in 1989, and I'm the Maths Master at Maths School. Now, ready for a new way of doing maths? Now, there are three different cases in which we'd need to calculate the median. The first case is if we have a list of data. The second case is if we have a table of ungrouped data. So that would probably be discrete data, something like um, the um, number of times you went to the cinema or number of seats in a car, things like that, things which can't be 3.12 or something like that. And then three, a table of grouped data. And the method we'd use would be different for each of these. So let's start off with the first case, a list of data. So if I have a list of data, I'm going to start off with um, a list of some data here on, um, maybe this could be uh, the number of cans of Coke um, that are um, drunk in a month by uh, some students. So I've got this data here. First thing I need to do with this data is to place it in numerical order. So I need to order the data. So looking at my data, smallest value is 20, so I'm going to put that first. Uh, 22, 23, I think I've got two of those. There's a 24 here. 227s, 229s, and a 30. So our first step is to list the data in numerical order. Once we've done that, we want to find the median, which is the middle one in the numerically ordered list. Now here I've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 pieces of data. And you might think that the middle one would be the fifth one, but that's wrong. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. There's the fifth one. If I just move that down and you count how many are to the left of it, 1, 2, 3, 4, and how many are to the right of it, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, you can see it's not actually in the middle. So. If you've worked out how many items you have in your data, that will be called n, then the median will be the a half n plus oneth value. So in my example, n is 10, there are 10 numbers there. So n is 10 plus one times a half, so it's 11 divided by two, is the five and a half value. Well, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. My fifth value is 24, and my sixth value is 27, so my five and a half value would have to be halfway in between those. So halfway in between 24 and 27, add them up, 24 plus 27, divide it by 2, and so that gives me 25.5 is my median. Now 25.5 isn't any of the numbers in this list of data, but you can see it would be the median because if I chose 25.5 as my median, then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 would be less than it, and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 would be more than it. So that's our first case, finding the median for a list of data.